Hi, how are you doing? I'm here in the home gym and wanted to share a point with you. I've been being asked a question this week around slim training experiences and chances of being able to develop a better body in 2023. Now, this is a question that comes up quite often, especially when there are a number of barriers to training exercise and good quality nutrition. Usually there are psychological barriers though that can be broken down over a period of time. Usually the person that's wanting to develop the physique and one uh, usually comes in with a little bit of slim training experience and maybe some poor eating experience, poor eating habits and poor eating behaviours prior to starting out or they might have gone through a number of different training programs but those have not created that magnet that allows them to consistently flow as they leave that program and move forward. So the point that I'm going to make to you if you're starting out this year or you've recently been uh, given a program to use within the gym whether that's a strength and conditioning program, a nutrition program to prepare your food in the kitchen or a program that's of sort trying to help you both health and fitness move forward this year is that usually people with that slim training experience and the poor eating experience and foundations can make astonishing gains and relatively great fat loss results in a very small period of time due to how the body will bind to that and once it takes on good quality nutrition alongside training and it's within routine and in sync with those two disciplines starts to see greater results in a, in a short term which will help psychologically give that individual the momentum to build a better stronger and leaner physique and also greater eating habits going forward. I hope that helped and answered the question. Have a fantastic week and all the best wishes. Hope you stay healthy, fit and mindfully in a good place. All the best.